Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna be making chicken kebab sandwich style. S sandwich style? Anyway, you got it what I said. So, my sister been requesting to me every time, make chicken kebab, make chicken kebab, cut the buffet kebab, cut the buffet kebab. So I'm like, okay, well my husband wanna eat it, so we're gonna make it today. What we need is, well, we only two person, right? So we're gonna be using only a half of a breast. We need uh, one, oh, one tablespoon of uh, onion powder, one tablespoon of uh, garlic powder. If you don't have onion powder and garlic powder, you can use shredded onion that you can take one onion and just shred it. Oh, you can put it in, Dave, how do you call this? The thing that crushes everything? The a blender? Yeah, a blender. Uh, you can uh, just put one, on a big green onion, and a uh, full glove of, uh, full glove, is it glove, right? Full glove of garlic. Is it full glove of garlic, right? Yes. And then you just crush it and keep it. You will need um, a half tablespoon of um, black pepper, a half tablespoon of salt, but it depends how you like your food. You can make it more salty. We like salty. Oh my god, David. Uh, then we will have one tablespoon of uh, paprika powder. You can use sweet or you can use a uh, ro uh, not roasted, but uh, smoked paprika. And uh, half, not half, yeah, half teaspoon of cinnamon powder and one third, one third teaspoon of cloves powder. Cloves, cloves, or gloves. <laughs> I would say gloves. Cloves powder. Zeroff. And then we will need a sour lemon. A half lemon. You can use one. If you're having the little lime one, you can use the, the whole thing. It depends. But if you're using the bottle one, then you can um, just use two tablespoons or one tablespoon. Like I said, it depends how you want to taste it. Like you want the taste to be a little bit sour or not. And then you will need one tablespoon of honey. Or one tablespoon of uh, oil. Oil. You can use any oil that you want. Also, this recipe requires yogurt. But I don't have yogurt right now like plain yogurt you can use plain yogurt you can use Greek plain yogurt but normally we had yogurt at home but today we don't have so I tried without yogurt before and it tastes the same thing so I guess it's better so here we go we're gonna start it Put the chicken away. Put the chicken away. Put the chicken away. So we're gonna start with the onion and the garlic powder. Gonna mix it a little bit. All I need is a little bit. And then we're gonna add the paprika. The cinnamon and the glove powder, mix it again, mix it, mix it, and then we add the black pepper and salt. I put a little bit more of black pepper powder because we like that flavor. So this is the end. You 
can you I just add a little bit more of oil oil mix it and you add I don't measure because I have eye measure maybe <laughs> maybe not and then you just add the lemon normally when you see your lemon a little bit hard don't show put it in the microwave for five seconds ten seconds gonna get a little bit loose and then you can get a lot of juice but in meanwhile we can just mix it mix it mix it normally if you have yogurt inside in the bowl I mean it will be different, right? But I don't have the yogurt, so I will be just using this. Do you have any question so far, David? No questions. This is why I hate. I try to remove the seed inside. Jesus. Don't want seeds in our in our mix. You don't want what? Don't want seeds. <laughs> you, need, you need a hand squeezing the lemon. Yes, I need a hand squeezing squeezing squeeze. I don't need you to squeeze me. Squeeze just the lemon. <laughs> okay. 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 Mix it. Mix it. Wait, you're getting more seeds inside. Jeez, it's how many heat seeds. <laughs> Listen, lemon seed, we're not gonna grow you today, so. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. You can take, keep it and rub it in. Can keep it in the fridge. Or you can just dump it in your organic bag. It will make it smell good. be honest, I actually like it better this way without the yogurt. That's just my opinion. But it's good both ways. I'm using a small bowl because I have half chick uh, breast, chicken breast. But if you are a family of five, six, seven, eight, use how many breasts you want. Not boobies. But breasts. Okay. Um can you cut that part? Can you cut the mix part? it mix it? Did you marinate the chicken? I did it with my hand because I don't think everybody wanna see me doing it with my hand. Yes, I did wash my hand and I uh, used lemon when I did it. Like I rubbed lemon on my hand and I did it. So I marinated it with my by hand is because it get to every single part of the chicken so that the spice the the spice go the marination sauce goes in every layer, every side of the chicken. And I suggest you actually to cut your chicken into slices. It will be easy to cook. Like when you're gonna be, you will see how we're gonna cook it, but it will be easy for you to cook it. Okay. And this marination will be for one or two hours. If you're using yogurt overnight or six to eight hours. All right. For see you later, bye. Three hours. So right now. We're gonna start chopping all the vegetables. I already shred the carrots. I already chop the onion. So now we're gonna chop the cabbage. I already wash it. Don't forget guys, always wash the vegetables. Right David? Mm-hmm. Just be careful, don't chop your finger. <coughs> Yeah, Yubi, don't chop your fingers. I don't chop my finger. I 
like this knife. Just get into it. This one is like this. This one you just like. What? You don't like onion? No. Well, not raw onion, but who likes raw onions? I see every people who love onion. Okay, never cut it this part like this. It will get juicy. Why? It will get juicy. Why? What do you mean? Why? Are you? Are you your nephew? Yes. We're gonna keep that part. Don't you want to cut the core out? I will. We're gonna keep that part for you. Yes. And uh, later. I love pineapple. You what? I love pineapple. Normally, I don't remove it. You like to eat the core? It's sweet. This is where you get all the seeds. But it's not Mauritian pineapple, so it's not the same. What's the difference? Mauritian pineapple is a little bit more sweeter and a little bit more Ooh, yellow. Even better. I gotta get me some Mauritian pineapples then. Why? Because I like sweet stuff. Why? Like you. I turned chocolate today. Yeah, if nobody noticed, my wife got a little bit tan today. Go check it out on your Instagram. <laughs> yeah, go check it out on my Instagram at David Pierce. Not the DIP foodie Instagram, my personal Instagram. My personal Instagram. Hey, stop mocking me. Stop mocking me. Can I tell my mommy about you? <laughs> ah! I got nothing to say. I got nothing to say. Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me? Get back. You know, we get it, we get good. We didn't go to the, oh. the airplane. Now, now you're mocking a five year old girl. I'm not mocking. Bully. I'm not mocking. Stop. Imitating. Yes. This is the word you have to say. It actually is really bleed. funny. She likes to imitate my little five year old nieces. It's so funny. <laughs> And then, and then, no, it's, it's the nephew. Oh. And then, and then you say, bear. And then, and then <laughs> you say, yeah. So cute. Uh, I wish I could put cute. them in a video, but I don't think my brother would approve. No, I don't even approve for that. Now everyone's going to be in the comments. Put your niece and nephew in the video. Nope. I'm gonna cut that part too. Cause you just say mocking. That will consider to be bullied on YouTube. Oh. And then and then and then <laughs> a little three years old. So you you chop the pineapple. Okay, my sister when he when she told to my nephew. Well, I'm making that video for her, so anyway. She talked like this to my nephew. You so you so you cut you cut the you cut the pineapple. Okay? You cut the pineapple. You cut it. Chop 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 like this. Like little little So now we cooking the chicken. Then how we cooking the chicken? As you can see, oh, it I smells delicious. 
I spray what's olive oil spray? Yeah. Olive oil cooking spray. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm still learning English. Don't judge me. Yeah. <laughs> Her English is better than some Martian. Mm, don't say that love. I did. So David, you know, when you go to Murray Shorts, when yeah. you go to Murray Shorts, when you go to Murray Shorts, um, this is our fast food. Oh, you know, I always tell you that. So, every place, places that you're going, like every area, they have kebab. Like, um, like, like well, they say chicken, it's chicken kebab, mm. but... I would say it's um kind of a sandwich because here kebab is like doner, right? Mm -hmm. It's not the same. So we're starting to get everything red together, together, David, ready, together. It's ready. Frying the onions. Frying the onions. Fry the onion, David Dum Dum. <laughs> hey. You need a timeout. <laughs> no yawning. <sighs> oh my goodness, I have to clean the house tomorrow. <sighs> Thank God I got Mr. Clay with me. <laughs> You're not Mr. Clay, David. Yeah, I am. No, you're not. You're not Mr. Clay. You're Mr. Dirty. So, why... Hey, I'm Mr. Clean's twin brother, Mr. Dirty. Jeez. The elbow one? Okay. So, the... Onion. Starting oh. to cook a little bit. Say I'm sorry for yawning, cause I I hear I heard that. No, I covered my mouth. Yeah, I heard. Uh oh. Die onion. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> you were supposed to do that with the camera. <laughs> no one can see you doing this. Oh my my, oh my my. Okay, fine. The onion is starting to cook. So then, we add the carrots. The carrots! You know carrots are good for your eyes, eh? You never knew Don't that was good know. for your eyes. The chicken will be a little bit messy, doesn't matter. Your husband can clean it after. Right, my husband? No. He, he. Cabbage! What? Did that sound like garbage? I meant cabbage. <laughs> well, the cabbage wasn't bad. Cabbage. Holy moly, snowy. You eating veggies today, David? Woohoo! Look at my cabbage from chopped thinly. Look at that. Look at that, David. Look at that, David. You're not looking. You should be using the big pan. Mm -hmm. The wok. Use the wok. So, let the vegetables cook a little bit and then we're going to add the pineapple in. Meanwhile, you can do a dancing. David, David, David is David, David is David. UV, 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 eh, eh, UV, 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 eh, eh, eh. David. 
high five. Mm. Another high five. Up. How to jump. Yeah. That's too. I, I cannot. I cannot. Uh, I will have to touch this. Oh. I have to just do. Oh, look at that, guys. Only if you could smell it right now. It smells amazing. It's only really vegetable. Yeah, but it still smells amazing. I thought you didn't like onions. I like cooked onions. It's, you're still eating it half raw. I tell everybody my secret. <laughs> Oops. I hope mom is doing salsa again. Pineapple in it. Ooh, pineapple. Mm -hmm. You yawning? No. What time you woke up today? Five thirty. No, that's not true. Yeah, but then I went back to sleep. Then I woke up at six forty-five. Chicken! Chicken! Get the plate ready. Where's the sauces? Ah! There's no sauces. We didn't make any of the, 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 the. You don't really have to do the mayo thing, okay? The ma if you really want it. Um, the merchant version that you actually going buy, you buying it in the fast food way. Just take mayo, a little bit of black pepper, a little bit of water, make it like a little bit of liquid, like you eating ketchup, same way, and you're done. If you want it the same way, I will turn off my thing because my. My rock, my rock pan is very warm, so I will cook for the one of the pan, right? Right, David? Yes. Right? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. And here you go. You got authentic chicken kebab. Do we have to add more chicken for you? You want more chicken in it? Yes, more chicken. Alright. More chicken! Mm. Go grab the sauce, meanwhile. Go grab the sauce. Yeah, filming, I'm saying go grab the sauce. Ketchup, mayo, sriracha, please. Uh -oh. <laughs> and you told me that. Break it! Break All it! Right. Break it! So now we're not supposed to put the plate on this one. I'm getting lazy. So, I know, it's a big bread. Wow. Normally, I like to add lettuce on top after that. I'm done. David likes to have cheese on his. But I'm not going to do all the stuff. It's too late right now. It's 9.27. But you can add lettuce if you want. You can add. I'm gonna add more cabbage because I like it when it's a little bit raw. David was taking time to get the sauce, so it's a little bit cooked. Pineapple. Oh, pineapple. Pineapple. 
Yeah, it's always getting messy because. And there you have it. <laughs> oh wait, that's someone else's line. That's Kyle. There you go, guys. And that's the kebab. No, it's not yet kebab. What would the? What's next? You've got. Oh, the sauces. Need a little bit of mayo in there. Uh, I don't know how the white people like their mayo. Olive oil. Mm. It's healthier, apparently. No, I just like this one. It doesn't really taste the mayo mayo. Your ketchup, ketchup is burping. Hmm, forgot to buy sriracha. Anyway. You grabbed them. No, I didn't. Life problems. I always forget something. And that is something that is beautiful. It is art. And wait. Hey, bread, don't go away. I will add more. Put some fresh cabbage on top. Cabbage, like, I don't want to get filmed. I got lazy, so I put cabbage. But normally I put lettuce in it. Or if David wants cheese, he put cheese on. And here, here you, you go, go, guys. Their chicken kebab sandwich style. So we got David to try it. Let's see what he says. Alright guys, this is very yummy. I like the pineapple. It gives it a nice, nice little sweet kick in there. Mm -hmm. Com it complements the savory and the spicy all in one. Mm -hmm. Very good. So, are you ready to go to Mauritius now? Yep. Yeah. I'm ready to go to my All right, for guys. a whole year. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, comment down below what you want us to do next. Have a good one. Peace.